So it's going a little bit too zoomed in. There we go. I can zoom it out though. Oh, it must have stabilization too. This looks great. I do burger. I'll find one of you guys that's got another one of those. I may actually have. Yes, sir. Are you gonna fly anymore? I'm gonna fly right now. I'm uh, focused on trying to catch some video of my friend Bob here. Whoa, and I've lost him. There we go. But after I've done that, I am gonna fly. Nice. I think I caught that on a low pass. Excellent. Who's flying that one right there? The black one. Man, they're awesome. I switched my viper jet to a chainsaw. Can't beat those guys. Look, he just jettisoned some ballast. <laughs> <laughs> Caught that one. It is amazing if you watch this. If you watch the wing tip, they take the flare and they take that cannon. It'll be fine on five cells. I think it's flying good, Bob. I had a radio. Uh, maybe a little close on that one. Bob, you got another rocket drifting down at the top. 200 feet in the air. All you got to do is avoid the paragliders, the rockets, the horses. On the runway, Bob. You gotta go around. Yeah, I'm just making sure. Always better to over communicate than not enough. All right, landing left to right. Landing left to right. Oh, it's a little bumpy, man. Wow. Oh, man. Oh, and then you got a side gust at the end. Oh, yeah, you got the side gust, but you did good. That was a great landing in tough conditions. 